Hello, I'm Rachel Zimberry, Chair of the Arlington Redevelopment Board, also known as the ARB, and I will be taking you through Warren Article 30, a bylaw amendment related to solar energy systems for the 2022 Annual Town Meeting. Ground-mounted solar installations are allowed by right in the industrial district only. Solar energy systems in other districts require a building permit but are not prohibited. In historic districts, additional guidelines apply. Since 2010, the town has continued to modify its requirements related to solar energy systems, and in 2021 received unanimous endorsement of the Net Zero Action Plan by the Select Board. This amendment follows the guidance of the 2021 Net Zero Action Plan, which placed this amendment as a priority measure. It identified that solar energy systems are a key to achieving net zero greenhouse gas emissions by 2050 and calls for every building in Arlington to be net zero energy capable by 2050. To achieve that goal, effectively, all suitable rooftops in Arlington would need a solar energy system, 75% of the total or 9,000 roofs. Looking at local precedents, there are towns with solar bylaw requirements, which include Watertown for new and large commercial, Medford for new and large residential and non-residential, and there are towns with design review for solar systems, which include Somerville, Cambridge, and Boston. There are also towns with municipal green building policies, which include Lexington and Wellesley. This proposed amendment begins by defining a photovoltaic system, roof mounted solar voltaic, so excuse me, roof mounted solar photovoltaic systems solar energy systems, solar ready building, solar ready zones, and solar thermal systems. A project requiring environmental design review shall include a solar energy system that is equivalent to at least 50% of the roof area of the building or buildings that are the subject of the review. Where a site includes a parking structure, the structure shall also have a solar energy system that covers at least 90% of its top level. The amendment identifies conditions where a solar energy system on the roof of a building or other structure is not required. The ARB can reduce or waive requirements when the applicant proposes and the ARB determines that there is a better alternative that meets the goal of this section. The amendment sets out regulations for emergency access and safety. Solar energy systems shall not be counted in determining the height and gross area of buildings. This amendment also covers solar, solar energy system placement. System placement cannot preclude a neighboring property owner from constructing, renovating, or expanding a building to the full extent allowed by zoning, even if the neighboring property owner's building would partially or fully shade the installed solar energy system. Nor can the placement of a solar energy system on a building, as required by this bylaw, require that a neighboring property owner prune an existing shade tree or abstain from planting a shade tree so as to prevent future shading in the installed solar energy system. This amendment is a significant step towards enacting policies recommended in the town's 2021 net zero action plan. The ARB voted five to zero at our April 4th meeting to recommend favorable action on article 30. Thank you.